What are we talking about today? Uh, mistakes. Oh yeah, mistakes. What specifically? Who? What celebrity was actually uh, recently injured on the set of her movie? Um. <laughs> who? <laughs> Jennifer Lawrence. Jennifer Lawrence. <laughs> What's up? I'm Percy. This is Rissy. Mercy is. Camera. Oh. For what? We have a um, webcam too that's what 1080. Are you prepared for? You can help me later. You guys focus on your thing first. No, this is the topic. Getting you ready for your webcam. <laughs> no, that's not what we're talking about. Camera. Don't worry about it. She just said it. we gotta leave her alone. No, no, you don't have to leave me alone. I just don't want to distract you from your thing. Oh, this is this show's about you today, Merce. What? <laughs> no. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh man, now I feel bad. Welcome, finally, to the hit grand opening of the brand new, critically acclaimed, internationally lauded morning show called the Podcast Show Whoa. Where every day we upload a new episode that's hopefully something interesting, inspiring, motivating, educating, and distracting. A little distracting. By the way, we have our own pod podcast. Now. So we launched our own podcast, the Half Cap Show podcast. Podcast? What? What? It yes. It's amazing. Yeah. You've already watched like five. I know, and it's so great. Yeah, I, I like the it. attitude. It's not even scripted, folks. That's that's the real thing. We're not going to stop doing the videos because we really enjoy doing the videos, but we're just stripping the audio from this and throwing it up on Spotify and Apple and Google. Right now, I think we're only on Spotify. An exclusive Spotify special. It's not exclusive either. Well, it's exclusive because it's only on Spotify. If you want to listen to this podcast, you can only get it on Spotify. <laughs> Until Apple and Google say we can be on their platforms. <laughs> if you're new here, please subscribe or follow our podcast wherever you get your podcast. Sp Spotify. <laughs> <laughs> Found it. Okay. Today is... <laughs> Monday, <laughs> January 8th. January? Febu February? It is February, and you're right about the 8th. Good job. Yeah, yeah. Monday, February 8th. Laugh and get rich day. I'm not sure I understand this holiday. How do those things go together? I'm not sure, but if it's true, all we have to do is laugh, make other people laugh, especially on our new podcast on Spotify. And we're going to make tons of money. You want to sponsor our podcast that just launched on Spotify? Um, <laughs> Recommended on uh, Spotify and podcast because that's kind of new and we want to get that going. So true, that's true. Yeah. Don't abandon us on YouTube though. Do not unsubscribe. Do not hit that unsubscribe button, right? Or you're gonna get the face. <laughs> don't scare them. Please don't scare them. This was crazy news. Jennifer Lawrence. She was reportedly injured by flying glass doing a stunt in her new movie. What? Why yeah. would there be flying glass? How I'm not... We, I don't... Does glass have wings or something? Well, no, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Uh, it's a new Netflix comedy that's coming out called Don't Look Up. There's a lot of good people in this thing. I mean, it's nuts. It's Leonardo DiCaprio, Meryl Streep, Timothy uh, Chalamet. I think that's how you say his name. Uh, Ariana Grande, Kate Blanchett, Jonah Hill, Kid Cuddy, and Matthew Perry. Jennifer Lawrence, she gets hurt. And this isn't the first time she's gotten hurt either. Jennifer Lawrence, one of her first kind of come to fame kind of series of movies was The Hunger Games. She was in those. I mean, she's done a lot of stuff, but a lot of people know her from The Hunger Games. She said she went deaf in one ear for months. She was diving in the water a lot. So she got ear infections from that. And then there was a jet that took off uh, in one of the scenes and it punctured her eardrum. So that was crazy. Then something else that happened that caught a lot of people's attention. She won an Oscar back in 2013 and as she was going up the steps to do her acceptance speech, she fell. And when she fell, she said it completely kind of jostled whatever she was gonna say. So she gave this really weird speech. Uh, and my family, Happy birthday, Emmanuel. Um. You know, she talked about it being a horrific humiliation. I bring it all up because even someone like Jennifer Lawrence, someone who's as successful as Jennifer Lawrence, can go through some tough stuff, right? 
Like, whether it's mistakes on set, things happening to her, Wait, or... Wait, so... Mm-hmm. How did the flying glass happen? I have no idea how the flying glass happened. They haven't really, and like, why, given us a lot of news on this flying glass, glass. flying in the air? Well, people who do stunts, especially their own stunts, on movies and stuff, they're exposed to a lot of different stuff. Like, some people get stunt doubles, they call them, where they have someone else do the work. But some people, like Tom Cruise, they love doing their own stunts. Because when they do their own stunts, you can get much better kind of shots, right? Like if Tom Cruise is on the side of a plane as it's taking off, there can be a camera right in his face capturing all of it. But if it was a stunt double, now the camera can only probably capture his back or him from very far away, that kind of thing. Like zoomed in. Right. Zoomed out. If it was a stunt double. Yeah. So, she's probably doing some stunts, probably thinks like, hey, the, the show, the movie can capture some more interesting moments if she's doing the stunt. So that's why she was doing the stunt, probably. And as for the flying glass, who knows? Like, they're supposed to use things that are, like, not real glass for movie making. They make, like, a glass out of, like, I think it's almost made out of sugar or something like that, where it breaks and, like, it's it's safe. It's not going to cut you and stuff. And it breaks into a lot of pieces. But I don't know. You can imagine even something that's in pieces, if it's flying around, it still might cut you or something. I don't know. We ha There's no video of her getting cut. I probably would uh, skip the whole stunt career because it sounds dangerous. Mm. So. I, I see you in gymnastics class. You're doing, like, handstands on the door next to a bunch of things that if you fell... There's going to be some damage. Everything can't be risk-free. I think that's another topic here, right? She, she's she got this career. It's also got risks. Everything isn't risk-free. You do have to kind of pick things that have certain amounts of risk. It's, there's no getting away from all of it. And also, you know, she made a mistake with the whole red carpet thing. No matter how, like, successful you are, you're out there making mistakes, too. Yeah. Why did she fall on the red carpet? Why did she fall? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I think she was wearing like a really nice dress. And I think it's one of those things where you trip on your dress kind of thing because it's long and you're going upstairs kind of thing. You know what it's time for? The joke of the day, also known as the Cobra Pony Percolator of <gasps> Except what? What can it be? So she's really at all. But she's really, really... Uh, guinea pig, which is really, really, really a dragon, which is really, 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 really a bunny, but she really, 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 really the best and furry, and she's also really, 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 really a dog. <laughs> Good job on the percolator, Dan. That is awesome, buddy. Speaking of mistakes, Merce. Yes. I was doing some research. Did you think about my mistakes? <laughs> no. But this is a crazy fact I discovered while researching mistakes yesterday. Okay. Did you know that every dictionary? I'm not looking at your <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> What are you doing in camera? <laughs> what is it? What is the joke? Can I see the punchline? Oh my, my gosh. goodness. You can get in camera. We would love to see you more, but don't steal the joke, Merce. So fun fact, Merce. Yes. Every dictionary has at least one mistake in it. Okay. Did you know that? No. In the end section right after miss. Uh, thank you so much for being here and being a subscriber to the Half Calf Show. Whether you're watching it or listening to it. If you're not a subscriber, you're going to get in huge trouble. And we <laughs> will talk to you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. You know, Marissa's listening to the podcast. But she's not subscribed. She might be. We're hoping she is. I'm pretty sure I Go am. check. I'm going to